So this is the demo portion um, to show the usage of Xcode and PhoneGap to deploy HTML, CSS, and JavaScript applications uh, to an, in this case, an Apple device. However, you can also use it to deploy it to Google Android devices, BlackBerry devices, um, things like that. So essentially this is just an HTML page and, and all this HTML page does, it uses jQuery to sense the type of browser being used and then it applies the correct um, CSS file for display uh, of that web page within that particular browser. Very simple page, all it, all, it, all it really does is have links and information about me in this page. And so um, what you can do though is you can take this page and deploy it to Xcode and deploy it to the www folder. I don't know if you can see that there, it might be a little blurry but it's right near the top. Um, the um, all that the entire application just goes in that folder and then when you hit build and run it will deploy it to the Apple device and my lovely bride Linda is um, uh, has the Apple device up and Linda if you would click on the Vaughn practice icon there what happens is that it, then it brings up the exact same application uh, written in HTML CSS and JavaScript, but bundled as an Objective-C application. Uh, we're looking at compiled code here, um, and what what happens is that it just displays the, the exact same uh, application, but rendered for an iPad, iPhone, and iTouch. So, Linda, if you would hit that menu button, essentially all, all that does is that on click, it will show all the links um, that were uh, on that HTML page, but but shows but show them in a uh, format that iPhone, the iPad, and the iTouch can understand. You would hit that menu button again, please, my love. Thank you. And then it, if you hit a menu again, it collapses that information and just shows the about page and the um, information about me. And, and so that's it. What what we've done is that we've taken an HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Uh, mini application dragged and dropped it into PhoneGap in an Xcode um, IDE and then using the IDE we, s we built and ran it and deployed it to the iPad and now we're showing it.